Bill, we love White Linen Night. <laughs> Good morning again, LBJ and Amy. Now we've already found out that Damon will be here for White Linen Night, and also Leslie. Yes. Leslie has a gallery right around the corner, and I, it's called. I do Spillman Blackwell Fine Art. And you are Leslie. I'm Leslie Claire Spillman. I'm the president of the New Orleans Arts District Association. Say hello to LBJ and Amy and everybody out there because we're hey glad to have you. Thank you. And why is White Linen Night such a big deal, particularly this year? Well, this year we're really excited that for the first time ever we're expanding the block party footprint. So it's not just going to be what everybody knows on Julia Street, but also a secondary location for the block party on St. Joseph by our friends at the CAC. It's not just Julia Street anymore. Yeah. Although you'll be on Julia Street. Yeah, I'll be on Julia Street. But you're welcoming Street. everybody else coming in. Yes, indeed. Well, let's take a spill and a spin. This is Jonathan Maye, a Baton Rouge artist that we're looking at all around us one of the exhibits here at this gallery. Why is it you think people look forward to White Linen Night? Well, really, our organization founded this event in the early 90s as a way to sort of drive some business to the galleries in the dead of summer when we don't have a lot of tourists and we don't have a lot of foot traffic. And it's just sort of grown exponentially over the years. So it went from a necessity and like, oh, let's see if we can do something to something that is so spectacular. 20,000 people will travel from all over the globe. Yes, we're expecting 20,000 this year easily. We might even creep beyond that. I think we might actually set a record, but it's really just, it's an event that so many people look forward to in the summer when there's not a whole lot going on. And it's also kind of a scene. You can don your white and be seen and bring your tribe and see some amazing art. Let's see, 20,000 people, that's 40,000 eyeballs yeah. that will get a look at your beating work. Right. And, right. and, and, and at you as well. Did, did you see the way this guy is dressed? Oh, yeah. I mean, he dresses for success. From top, where'd you get these jeans? Um, my, friend, my friend made these. Yeah, my friend hooked these up for me. And I like the shoelaces as well. Oh, thank you so much. Yeah, you, thank you, you, so much. you will stand out. Uh, as for everybody else, we'll be sort of dressing in our best white attire. People look forward to this. You can walk around, and it's primarily free. Yeah, it's a completely free event. It's free admission to all the galleries and museums. Of course, it is a fundraiser for our nonprofit, so we'll have bars set up. We have some really great specialty cocktails. We have water from Evermore, our friends and partners in this event, and even some frozen cocktails, and also food trucks. We have 15 food trucks, some of New Orleans' finest. So come thirsty and hungry. Yeah, and, and come to see Damon, because he, as an artist, you open your heart up to your soul. Yes, indeed. And what is it you want people to see? I want them to see all of this bee work that I'm doing and that I've been doing for over the last three years during the pandemic and everything. So, yeah, come on out and see all of this work. We'll see you. We'll see you, Leslie. And, and we hope to see you and LBJ and Amy at White Linen Night as well. Five to ten yes. Saturday. I think all we'll right. be there. We'll all be right. there. Thank you so much, Bill.